What's up everybody, Blaze Jedi here, and welcome back to our Frog Hopper 64 Island Carrier Command 2 campaign. Last time, we just captured Fornox, which was, I believe, a Tier 3 Island, and absolutely kicked our keisters. We have no more Air Force, and as such, we have a new plan. We're going to go take the Island of Traffic, we're going to then dip down, take the Island of Terminus, and probably from here also go here to Avernus just pop these three islands um, and start restocking on our ground vehicles and our air vehicles because at the current moment we have no more air chassis we have one more razor bill we no longer have oh we have a bear on board finally but we no longer have walruses we have a couple seals um, and yeah Alrighty, so once this little buddy gets back on board, we will go ahead and be on our way. Alright, so we are now leaving Farnox. We are starting our trip over. Let me put us on the right bearing before we go die. We're heading over the traffic. Hopefully we don't run into another torpedo battle because I don't really think we have a lot of torpedoes left. This should just be a smooth trip. Um, I can't imagine us running into much trouble. Now what I want to do real fast... So this is Petrels and Mantas. This is Albatross and Mantas. This is... Oh, this gives us Warruses. Okay. I think that's a rocket pod. What level is that island? <laughs> there are two boats on the radar. Whoa, that's a lot of contacts. Okay, so we have three ships in the water right next to us. Hold on. We gotta have weapons on Oh no, here we go again, and I just took off all of our waypoints because I keep hitting R instead of E. Okay, so what are we dealing with here? We have 048, 071, 071. I don't know what kind of boats these are, so this should be interesting. We're just going to do this. Let's go ahead and launch... Let's give it a 30 second activation. Torpedo 1. Let's go 59. Torpedo 2. And then on the same bearing. And now we're going to split the difference. And fire a noisemaker. I think these activated and all looked at this target. I fired three torpedoes. Where's the third one? Uh-oh. 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 That's not good. Oh, hit the wrong button. That torpedo sees us. Here it comes. Ah, noisemaker. Noisemaker, noisemaker, noisemaker. <clears throat> Come on, noisemaker. Disable, turn in. Brace, 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 brace. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, we have successfully de de defeated that guy. <clears throat> Just in time for us to watch this happen. Oh, this guy's so dead. I did not mean to shoot three torpedoes at him, by the way. I really only meant to shoot the one, but you know what? I'll take it. Come on. Just one shot, kill it. One shot, kill it. Okay, so we now know this is a swordfish. And this second torpedo is going to somewhere else. There is another two ships down here. That's a swordfish. You can tell by the wings. Oh, look! My torpedo went down and hit it. What? No, that wasn't my torpedo. Chat, you know what that was? That was the torpedo we spoofed. It must have came down all the way here and waxed this. That's funny. All right, we are now approaching traffic. I believe I'm close enough now that I should launch a Albi. We are going to put on two of the articulated cameras in random places and just see how they look and hopefully don't lose the Albi in the process of course guys 
Uh, I have a ship control or a captain seat mod. Uh, uh, I think it's called Captain Controls. These torpedoes went to Never Never Land, um, which is how I can use my commands in the captain's chair. Very helpful if you're playing solo like I am. There shouldn't be any AA on this island. Emphasis on shouldn't, so it should be okay to just roll up here, but we'll find out soon. Oh, game stuttered a little bit there. Not too sure why. I don't think that has AA on it. I think that's only a gun and torpedo. Let's find out right now, though. Torpedo gun. Okay. We'll use a guided missile. He's heading towards the carrier. Get the second one in the air. <laughs> I was panic hitting buttons, chat. There's a torpedo in the water. Uh-oh. Come on, missile. You need to go faster, buddy. Come on. 800 to target. 500 to target. 300 to target. 100. Impact. Oh, a torpedo hit us on the nose. Okay. Oh, we took a lot of rounds. Oh, there's the screenshot right there. <laughs> oh, shit, they have a Petro. Um, this isn't good. Okay, okay, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. What we need to do... You need to come back. Because once you're in range, we'll send up a Sam. Um, it looks like all of our SAMs are still working. We're down a Sea Whiz, though. Fire one. Oh, it splashed itself in the water. Okay. Okay, we are repairing. <laughs> in truth, I probably should have uh, stayed in the carrier for that, but it's all good. Chat, please excuse my coughing. I'm still not over whatever weird bug um, I unfortunately got afflicted with. Once we're in 2000, when fire. Looks like it fired one at me. And splash one. And yes, chat, we totally did just do a barrel roll. It says I can lock on to that, but what is it? Alright, box two. Well, whatever it is, it's dead now. A seal in the wall, with There is... A petrol taking off. You know, out of curiosity, missile away. Uh oh, he's already off. That missile might not hit now. Nope, okay. Well, let's fire the last one at this turret. Here comes the sun, doo 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 doo. Here comes the sun, and I'd say it's all right, doo 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 doo. Here's my plan. Plan. We are gonna launch a helicopter. I will take direct control of it, and basically what we will do is gun all of the horses 
The only thing I wish about this carrier is that it I wish it had multiple elevators, because trying to launch air assets all at once is a process. And there's our razor bill. Ooh, kind of a rough takeoff there. We need to be within a thousand uh, is the effective range of these guns, so. <clears throat> Let's get in close. That's a lot of fire. Some in the water there, too. Can't see that guy. He's completely submerged. Oh, well, I got him. Another two over here. That round came really close. Holy moly. Alright, I got both of them. So, fun fact. I just found that they made Tom Clancy's End War backwards compatible on uh, Xbox Series X. And I still have the disc. So, at some point soon, we're going to have an End War stream. Okay, I think I've cleaned up this island. I don't hear anything shooting at me. We're about to beach the boat. Oh, we're really about to beach the boat. Oh god. Oh god. I said it as a joke, but no, it's actually about to happen. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Quickly. Quickly. You. Come home. Carrier. Oh, no! Don't beach the boat. It's, uh, it's a specialty of mine. Something is fucking engaging us. Oh, man, she's landing. I can't take control. You are going to die such a hard death right now. No such thing as overkill. <laughs> Alrighty, so... This island's all but ours. Um, we are waiting for the seals to get there. So basically what I'm going to do now that I know there's nothing left on the island is take control of the virus seal and send him in. And then basically RTB everybody else. I forget how slow these things are in the water. I think I need to find the mod that makes these vehicles faster. Hello. Are those torpedoes? Those are totally torpedoes. This one, I think, sees me. Um, That's a problem. Maybe it doesn't see me. Okay, so yeah. So here's basically what's going to happen. Um, we are... Let me look at the actual attack map. We are taking traffic... And then we'll sail down and grab Terminus real quick and call it a day. Um, Terminus will be a real quick capture. It's a one-star island. There shouldn't be much fight on it. Honestly, I can probably just roll up here, drop my seals, and not have to worry. So I think what's going to happen is we're going to come into contact with this enemy first. And then we'll f worry about this guy. What I'm interested to see is once we take out the two enemy carriers, what do you all think? Should we continue the campaign and go for all the islands? Or should we call it there since 
once you take, you know, the two enemy carriers out, there's really no threat. It's just island hopping. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think we should do. I think we should take all 64 islands, because I think it'll be more interesting. But I understand that a lot of these islands are airstrikes, vehicles, airstrikes. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. I was wrong. That torpedo did in fact see us. It might kill us. Brace for impact. Didn't look like it hurt us that much. Uh, hopefully what happened was that it actually hit the island. And actually, I don't really think it did much in the way of damage at all. Might have hit the sandbar next to us and... Uh, deflected some of it, so... Okay. Let's go check on the seal. Alright, we're here on the island. Honestly, because there's no threat, I'm gonna just drop the virus bots and bring this guy back in. Let me just get over this hill. Alrighty, and we're going to bring this seal home and start heading towards our next island. You know, chat, with this being only two stars, we could, instead of getting Terminus, get Edgely first. Come down the beacon and then just boop, boop, boop. That might be, that might be a better option, honestly. So we'll take Edgely, which will pretty much be the same thing as, uh, as this island. And then we'll go bop. Bop. We'll take everything down here. Just on our way. Just one, two, three. So what we'll do is we'll finish up with Edgely. Next time around, we'll capture Beacon, Bardland, and Terminus. And then we'll go to Avernus and move our way back over to Arcanid. Yeah, I like that idea a lot. Okay, cool. So we can restock everything from this island except our albatrosses, which is great. Because it means we can start outfitting and have units to spare. And that makes me really happy. <laughs> That's actually really cool. <laughs> Chat, I know it doesn't seem cool, but trust me, it's cool. Looks like a warus. Yeah. Something's taking off. Uh, not too worried about it. Thought there'd be more of a, a ship presence here, because I thought this is where the torpedoes came from. I think the torpedoes came from the level 3 island. And I just happen to be the unlucky sucker who, uh, who they went active on. That looks like everyone. As odd as that sounds. No turret? I mean, there's one way to tell. Come in low and drop this bomb. Good hit. We got one. Somebody's a little too close. Fire a missile. Our Sams are on it today. Let's get as close as we can. Ooh, 
Wow. That was a dangerous landing. Hi, buddy. I'm glad you made it, but holy moly. <laughs> That's a lot of bad guys. Oh, what is that? Hello. I'm hoping it ends up, like, right here. Nice. All right, so this is going to sound silly, but... <laughs> Send in everybody. Deploy the seals. We will take the fight to the enemy, whether the enemy wants to enjoy it or not. We're going to take control of the razor. All right, let's fly. Here we go. got an achievement, 100 air kills from a manual control vehicle. <laughs> Come on, Whirly Bird. about minimizing casualties right now. <laughs> Almost just made a mistake there. I don't know how the bots will work going into water, so I want to uh, make sure that we can just get in and out without any problems because the islands are basically connected by this little sandbar here. So chat, I just realized the problem. I can't make 20 millimeter shells or 20 millimeter guns. Um, now that doesn't sound like an issue, but it actually is a bigger issue than you would think because that's what we use in the air chassis. So there is going to be a point where we're just running guns. Uh, running missiles, rather. Um, that has the cannons I need. That's all the way up in nowhere's, nowhere land. That has cannons. But I want to take this side of the map first. And this has rocket pods and the 40 millimeter cannon that's a lot better than what we need for okay so that is a problem that will come up rather quickly <laughs> i think if i drop the bots here they should be smart enough to get there on their own so we'll do that and head home all right everybody so while this island is now starting to be captured we're gonna let's do a quick recap of the series so far so far Quick recap of the series so far, and we will talk about next steps. So, I've been really enjoying the series, and I hope y'all have been enjoying it too. Um, I just added in that camera mod, so I'm going to test it offline a little more and see what the best positions are for camera angles. Um, still upset that Fornox kicked our ass. 
Happy, though, that we can take two islands now, so traffic in Edgeley, and start replenishing our air command. Next episode, we'll do a three-parter, and we'll take Beacon, Bardland, and Terminus. Just because uh, it's a one, two, and a one, so it shouldn't be too hard with the units we currently have. Traffic is currently building a new air wing for us. We have ten Mantas on queue. Seven of them are built already. Ten Petras being built, and then, of course, ten Razor Bills. We still cannot replace the Albatrosses, but that's fine. Um, we are going to take Beacon for Fuel, Bardland for Barges, because if we can simplify this to be, like, four or five different barges, maybe, like, one for these two islands, one for these two, one for these two, and then one for these two... Uh, that will be kind of steady spaghetti. And then, once we take these three islands, we're going to go take Avernus. Hopefully, by the time we take Avernus, we have our supply of aircraft. We'll come back up here and take Arachnid. All right, so I'm going to finish up this capture off screen just because these virus bots are moving ever so slowly. And we'll be back with the island capture screen. Oh, fuck! Torpedo! Brace, brace, brace! Where did that even come from? God damn it. You know where that torpedo came from? It came off my nose, right? That torpedo came from this fucker right here. Trying to shoot my barge and missing the barge. All right, pretty people, we have successfully captured Edgeley, which gives us barges, which is great because we need those. So that's where we're blah, blah, blah. So this is where we're going to end it for today. Um, our barge is being chased by these two ships. That's why we took a torpedo not too long ago. <laughs> Next time on Carrier Command 2, we're going to take Beacon, Bardlin, and Terminus, and then we'll move to Avernus and come back here for Arachnid. Probably take Nemesis and then work our way east. The enemy carrier just took Starvos, so I believe he's going to be working east as well, uh, which means we'll come into contact with that ship soon enough, probably within the next episode or two. And yeah. All right, everybody. We're going to leave it here. I'm going to set, start setting our heading towards Beacon. And until next time, so long. Farewell. I hope you enjoy the series, and if you like this content, you know what to do. Later, party people.